Fast food workers were once again out protesting today in Detroit and across the country. They're demanding higher wages. Here in Detroit, the group calls itself the D15. Many of them work for the minimum wage at their jobs in fast food restaurants, but they say it's not enough to get by. They're demanding $15 an hour. That's more than twice the minimum. And I want them to know that the myth that they're sending out that this is for high school students, this is for college students, is not a true statement. This is uh, for mom and pop, mothers and fathers. This is for couples, uh, senior citizens who are working here. And they need to understand that they depend on their checks and they depend on money to survive to pay their house note, the gas, or lights, water, phone, etc. And we're tired of being paid 740. We can't support our families off 740 a week. We need a union. That's what we're fighting for. $15 an hour and the right to form a union. The protesters made stops at dozens of fast food restaurants all around the metro area today. This is part of a larger nationwide movement. Fast food workers have been marching in places like New York, Chicago, and St. Louis, as well as other cities.